after studying all the school shootings, uh, 672 shootings in a seven year period in this country, we never won. If it wasn't for this school opening up other people's eyes, Meadow would still be a dream. This is really just a compelling reason to me for the safety and security of tech and all the community that we serve. There's nothing faster than a dog running down a hallway to gunfire. You got the look of an angel with the protection of the devil. I was introduced to um, canines in the military. Then once I got out, I got into law enforcement. Again, I took up um, canines and working with them my whole career. He approached us specifically about the use of a canine within a school system differently than what we normally would have been exposed to. So we all have seen dogs in different environments, most particularly in school environments, and what they're utilized for. But this was a take on something completely different, certainly timely, and I felt, as did the Board of Education, enhanced what it is that we do here as far as safety and security is concerned. It really speaks to what we're dealing with as a society, uh, but most importantly, how we can add an extra layer of security to our school system as well. So when you bring a dog to a school program, you need a dog that looks the demeanor on one hand, but on the opposite hand, you have to have a dog that the superintendent would fall in love with and say, that dog has the look, but I love that dog too. Believe it or not, that was the hardest thing in this entire endeavor, was to find a dog that made the right fit. It was literally uh, love at first sight. So um, I knew she was the dog for us, the canine for us. And this is even prior to her having one second of training. So Mr. Nick cautioned me time and again, Yes, she's a beautiful animal. Yes, her response right now to this environment and to all of you is positive, but the rubber's gonna hit the road when we find out through training if she really is the, the dog for you, the canine for you. You see her seeing children walking down a hallway. Doesn't phase her. You see her see someone slam a car door or a stranger walking fast and she watches. It's 50% dog and 50% handler. They both have brains. They, they both can work together, but you gotta find the right handler that has the love of the game and is willing to learn from the animal, not just teach the animal. Officer Monera's family deserves a bunch of kudos um, because Meadow lives with them and Meadow has to integrate in with their family and did a beautiful job, but Mr. and Mrs. Monera and their family uh, were so respectful and responsive to us when we did the big ask. Uh, so Meadow's home is here, her work is here, but she goes home at night and remains with the Monera family and the uh, responsibility that goes along with that. If it wasn't for this school opening up other people's eyes, Meadow would still be a dream. We have been forward in our security efforts here since we opened and being very open and upfront and honest with the public and our school community as to what it was that we're doing. This is purely for safety and security of staff, students and visitors.